The next period of instruction will cover our laser database. The laser database should be a direct reflection of those cut conditions which reside in the machine's controller. Using these settings, we will adjust for auto tool settings according to size, as well as creating beam offset or kerf compensation with the settings. We begin by going to our laser database icon in order to get to the laser conditions. Note the different material types and sub thicknesses within each material. As a default, the software automatically chooses the current material you're programming for. The beam offset width is where the software recognizes the thickness of the laser beam. This can be set for each individual cut condition. We will use these settings later on to calculate for part size after common line cutting. The beam offset number is where the software chooses the D offset number that appears in your G code. This too can be set individually for each cut condition. Cut length can control auto tool settings by their size. These size settings can be adjusted for size to speed settings. Creating the hierarchy allows the software to recognize what parts should cut slowly and which should cut quickly using the condition speed. To import more conditions into your software from your machine, use the condition importer. You choose your machine, click next. You then use an Explorer screen to find the CND file you've backed up from your machine's controller. 